What's up, Warriors? This is Major Fitness Club Fit 15. This is our core hit workout. Warm up five to 10 minutes before starting this hit. Check out the list of exercises. Let's go. Let's get ready for two rumbo, guys. Let's get ready for this core hit round one. Starting out with our wide sit-up. Lean back, reach out wide, and come up. Slight bend in the knee, heels down, exhale as you come up. 20 seconds of work. This is round one of our core hit. About a second or two to transition to the next exercise, which will be our side bear crawl and go. You want to do about four steps, four crawls right and four crawls left. Got to move pretty quick to keep up with this hit, guys. Four right, four left. Get ready for a seated cycle twist, bent knee. Good. Lift that knee up to the opposite elbow as you twist, cycle twist. Exhale. This is our core hit. There are three rounds total. Let me know in the comments what you think of this workout. Get ready to run in place. Let's go run in place. You know, if you need, if running in place is too much impact for you, you can do mountain climbs, you can do burpees, you can modify whatever move suits you or suits your fitness level. Come on down for our super plank in an up position, lifting opposite arm and leg. Super plank. So these are the five exercises that we will be doing for the remainder of this hit. Core hit. And we're going to start at the top with our wide side sit up. Bent knees, lean back, open the arms out, reach back and come all the way up. Exhale. Inhale up, exhale up, inhale back, slow and controlled, wide with the arms. Getting ready for that side bear crawl up on hands and feet and travel side opposite arm and leg travel side side bear crawl all of our workouts for this month are going to be the hit we are concentrating on the hip i'm thinking about for the first quarter next three months are the first of the year i'm thinking oh I should say the first three months, the next three months. I'm thinking about doing, concentrating on the high intensity interval training workouts for the next three months. Let me know in the comments what you think about that. So I wanted to progress and we're starting out with doing hits, body weight, and I wanted to progress to using the bands at the hip. Jumping jacks, jack it out. Switched it up on you. I wanted to throw in some jumping jacks. Gotta keep, you, keep the warriors on their toes. Jack it out. Now, you know, if you can't do side jacks or jumping jacks, you can do alternating side jacks. Come down and get ready for our super plank, opposite arm and leg. Arm is straight, leg is straight. Super plank, keeping the abdominals pulled in, pulled in, keeping the core engaged, Lifting from the hip and shoulder. Let's start again with our wide side sit up. Lean back, reach back, come up. Lean back, reach back, and up. Again, there only there's only about a second to a second and a half. So you got to move quickly to transition to that next work, next exercise. Let's get into our side bear 
crawl side air crawl don't forget to check out my latest blog on high intensity interval training the benefits of high intensity interval training how often you should do in interval training and high intensity interval training is not something that you want to do every day you want to break it up into between 24 to 48 hours depending on your fitness level good cycle twist stand and run in place breathe the breathing is what's most important as well as the five to ten minute warm-up run in place I'm down get into that super plank position opposite arm and leg working your core working your glutes working your shoulders opposite arm and leg and that nervous system because we're balancing here draw that navel in breathing heavy and this is round one of our four hits getting ready for round two you know you want to rest two to three minutes between each round two to three minutes a great time to get a quick sip of water get ready for round two We're going to start out with our wide side sit up. Lean back, reach, and sit up. Come on up, reach back. This is round two. That two to three minute warm up. Are you taking the two to three minute warm up? Because the intensity is pretty high, high intensity interval training. You really want to work at about a, a level seven. In my blog, I'm also going to be talking about RPE, that stands for Rate of Perceived Exertion, and how you should use that to determine if you are working at the right intensity while doing your high-intensity interval training. Come on down, getting ready for our cycle twist. That's twisting opposite knee to elbow. Sit up nice and tall and twist tapping that opposite knee to your elbow twist sit up straight exhale as you twist let's get ready to run in place and go swing your arms run in place you can jump rope you can fake jump rope you can do jumping jacks mountain climbs burpees whatever you prefer to do doing this cardio segment of the the aerobic segment of this hit super plank opposite arm and leg now if you need to modify this move you can go into a basic bird dog that's on hands and knees and again you're just lifting opposite arm and leg but you know with major fitness club fit 15 the goal is to challenge yourself Hey, challenge your friend, challenge your spouse, your partner to do this workout. This is our core hit. Wide side, lean back, reach back, come up, exhale up, lean back, reach wide, exhale as you come up, squeezing those abdominals as you come up. Exhale as you lift, unroll, reach back. Getting ready for our side bear crawl, side bear crawl. Have a seat, cycle twist. As you twist, bring that knee up to that opposite elbow, 
cycle twist. Jack it out, jumping jacks. That two to three minute rest is necessary. It's part of the program. Remember, muscles are torn in the gym, fed in the kitchen, and built in bed. So while you're resting, that's when the muscles are repairing. It's not while you're doing your workout. And if you're doing your high intensity interval training correctly, you will need that 24 hour to 48 rest in between the workouts. Hit is not something that you want to do every day. Our wide side sit up, lean back. Now notice I'm lowering myself. I'm not just falling back. I'm working those abdominal muscles. Finish what you start. Every day, you have to hit that reset button. And side bear crawl. There's a lot going on with the pandemic and, you know, we're in the holiday season. So that even adds to more stress. And exercise is a great way to keep your stress level down. And cycle twist. Exercise is my me time. Feeling the burn. Remember, you don't stop when it hurts. You stop when you're done. And this is only round two. So we have one more round left. We're halfway through round two. Run in place. Along with the exercise, you know, you also need to eat properly because 20% fitness is only fitness and exercise is only 20% and 80% of it is nutrition. I like to say you can't outrun a fork. You can't outrun a poor diet. So that completes round two, getting your rest, two to three minute rest before starting round three, our final round of our core hit. Round three, get ready. We're going to start out with our wide side, wide sit up. Wide side sit up. Bring you back, reach out and over and come on up. So I'm not throwing my arms up to assist with, the, with coming up, with doing the sit up. My abdominals are doing the work. This is round three, our final round. Exhale, as you come up, moving on to our side bear crawl, side bear crawl. I had to perform this workout three times. <laughs> the first time I recorded it, it wasn't recording, so that was fun. You know, your mind will quit 100 times before your body ever does. This is our cycle twist. Feel the pain and do it anyway. Feel the pain and do it anyway. A client of mine once told me that pain is weakness leaving the body. <laughs> I like that. Run in place. You don't need diet pills, slimming drinks, waist loss gadgets, 
All you need is commitment and consistency. So don't, and don't be upset by the results you didn't get with the workout you didn't do. You got to put in the work. No one is exempt. Anyone that knows me know that I don't diet. I just eat according to my goal. Eat according to your goals, guys. I don't think no one eats to be unhealthy unless that's a goal. I don't know. It's not mine. I don't diet. I just eat according to my goals. Exhale as you come up. This is Major with Major Fitness Club Fit 15. Let me know what you think of this core hit. Side bear crawl. Working up a nice sweat. You know what we say, sweat is just my fat crying here. When I'm working out, I'm doing what's necessary to become who I want to be. Who do you want to be? Are you doing what's necessary? Cycle twist. Cycle twist, opposite knee to elbow. Let's get ready for those jumping jacks. Jack it out. Now, if you have any issues with your shoulders and lifting your arms up overhead, you can do jacks with a side raise or jack with a front raise. Don't forget to click the link in the description and read my latest blog post on HIT High Intensity Interval Training, the benefits, and how to get started. Opposite arm and leg super plank. Wide side sit up. The wide side sit up lets you know that we are starting another cycle or another set. For me, exercise is more than just physical. It's therapeutic. It is my me time. Uh, you know what? You can have worse habits, right? Keeping the body in a straight line. Have a seat. Cycle twist. Hands together. Bring that knee up. Twist opposite elbow to knee. Cycle twist. The best project you can ever work on is you. You know, you can't control anybody else, but the best project you can ever work on is yourself. Run in place. Run in place. Good things come to those who sweat. Are you sweating? Are you working up a good sweat yet? Come down for a super plank. If you're interested in a free consultation, visit majorfitnesswellness.com to schedule your free consultation. Mission complete. Yay, you did it. Congratulations, you just completed your core hit. This is Major with Major Fitness Wellness, and I will see you next time. Peace.